We know which women are the favorites to win this year's U.S. Open Championship, but who claims the championship when the tournament is all said and done? What's going on, everybody? It's John Eric Poli, and after I post a video on the favorites in this year's U.S. Open Championship, thought it'd be fun now to make the official prediction who will be your 2024 U.S. Open champion on the women's side of things. And guys, I am not going to waste any time. I'm going to give you my prediction right here off the top. And if it's going to be the Irana Sabalenka that showed up at the Cincinnati Open, that is, who, that is who's going to win this year's U.S. Open Championship. So there you go. That's the official prediction with Sabalenka. Let's just talk about what Sabalenka did at Cincinnati. Guys, we know she was banged up for a little while in the summer there. Uh, she had to pull out of Wimbledon, and then she didn't get off to the best start on the hard courts. But all of a sudden, she just turned that on at Cincinnati Open. Now, was that a fluke, or is finally everything actually all healed up and she's ready to give this thing a go? Because if that Sabalenka is going to be the Sabalenka that shows up at the U.S. Open, going to be very hard to get her out of there, guys. She's built for the hard court. She won the Australian Open uh, earlier in the year. She's had several deep runs at this U.S. Open, including making the finals last year. So again, if this if Sabalenka is healthy and the Sabalenka that just showed up at Cincinnati comes to this year's U.S. Open, look out for Sabalenka. Now, of course, again, you're going to have draws and matchups and, you know, who wins versus this one. I, listen, I, I get all that, but looking at this from a, you know, a big, long perspective, looking out, Sabalenka, when she's healthy, you're at the mercy of her racket. And like I said, that Cincinnati Open was the Sabalenka we've been waiting to see since the shoulder injury. If that shoulder injury is behind her, look out for Sabalenka. Now, you guys heard the list of favorites. You can make a case for, again, Pagula's been, Jessica Pagula's been playing very good. Paula Bedos has been playing very good. Don't sleep on Igor Fiontek, the world number one. We saw what Goff did last year. But there's something for momentum, guys. And right now, that Irena Sabalenka that we just set Cincinnati, again, that is the Sabalenka that we've all know and love. So look out for Irena Sabalenka. Now, here's the one thing I will say, guys, in any sort of tournament that's on the WTA Tour. The WTA Tour is very, very deep. There's a number of players that could win. I mean, look, just look at Wimbledon. Who had that circled on their bingo cards of how that tournament was going to play itself out, right? I know I certainly didn't. So whenever you look at a WTA tournament, there's so many players in contention. But again, like I said, guys, and I said several times throughout this video, that Sabalenka that played at Cincinnati is going to be very hard to beat. So look out for Irena Sabalenka at this year's U.S. Open.